We're going all around your house tonight, and this is the grand finale of our home show. Andrew Lessman is coming up uh, with Adam. They're going to give you a little sneak peek at what he has in store with his multiple Today's Specials. But when we offered this at a Today's Special price, it blew out of inventory. In fact, it is back for almost, a, it's pretty much like, it's, it's, it's pretty much like another Today's Special. EcoFlow, if you're not familiar with it, to me, they, well, they are really the pioneers, the originators, nobody does it better. This is like your own little power pack, your little power station. You choose it in your color of choice, so what is it? It is power, it's like a little generator. It's a generator without, you know, the gas or the little pull, you know, the pull thingy, I mean, anything that's scary. You don't have to have it out on your back porch, on your deck, with all these crazy extension cords. I mean, what good is power if you can't have it, or you need the power, in the kitchen for your fan, for your CPAP machine, for your small refrigerator, those little refrigerators for insulin or breast milk or medications that need to be refrigerated. The We're heading into hurricane season, believe it or not, among so many other things going on in America, and this is your power station. So you choose it in that great blue. It's kind of like a blue box blue, like the jewelry store. Then we have that gold, and we also have a rose gold. So gold and rose gold, those are two, the two right next to each other. And then, of course, we have it in the black and the white. Now, on the blue... We have 17 remaining. Oh, that, I was actually, it's so funny. I was just looking for the white. The white is completely gone. Interest-free payments, a little over $120 with free shipping and a 90-day return policy. And then I'm going to hop over here real quick. We also have for you the custom molded bag. We're going to go to my friend, Justin Smith, who's also going to take us on a tour of all the ports because the thing is you can plug in your lamp, you can plow, plug, in, plug in your you know power strip, you can plug in your fan. But Justin, I tell you, you're loving life, you're safe at home, but no matter what happens, you got the power on demand. Hello, my friend. Hi, Shannon, how are you? Good, good. Well, you know how much I love this item and I love you. And yeah. isn't it true, once people get it at home, it's a runaway customer pick, a runaway customer favorite, because in the world of generators or the world of power yeah. on demand, this, this is the missing link. And I think that's why so many people love it. Would you agree? Yeah, I, I would, you know, Shannon, and that's the thing is so many of us right now where, you know, preparedness is on the top of our mind, especially with hurricane season, remind you, be less than 30 days away that, you know, we should all be thinking of the unexpected things that might arise right now. You know, we've all been without power before, right? Whether it's for 15 minutes, 15 hours or 15 days, and we know how vulnerable it feels. So whether we're just sitting around having a nice dinner with our family and we get a rolling blackout or a storm comes through. It's as easy as literally taking the EcoFlow River out of the cabinet, off of the shelf, because it will hold a full charge for 12 months. It's giving you an industrial amount of power, 100,000 milliamps, which is going to be a perfect alternative to those big clunky gas generators. Like you said, you pull it off the shelf, you press a button right here, and this is it, Shannon. Watch this. I take it out of the box. There's a little button right here. That's my power button. Now I'm on. Now I have access to that industrial amount of power and all I have to do is start plugging things in. There's no fancy tricky setup. I want you to look at this as a 21st century battery powered generator. So what do I do? All I have to do is I brought lights and fans here. We're down south and it's a little warm out. So let's go ahead. Let's say our, our lights went out and let me get my cord here. So we'll go ahead and plug in our lights. You see there, my light came on. And one thing I want you to notice, Shannon, is that it is immediate power. There's no trickle or anything like that. It's also only 11 pounds. I know it, it, you know, I'm a guy, you know, you think, well, maybe he can lift a little bit heavier. It's only 11 pounds. It's about the size of a gallon of milk. It's completely portable. Wherever you go, you do not have to keep it outside like you do those big clunky gas generators. I've got my fan going, or not yet, but let's go ahead and plug in my fan. These right here are where the EcoFlow River is worth its weight in gold. You're like, how is he plugging in the light in the fan? Look around your house right now. Virtually anything that you can plug in around your house, you can plug into the back of the EcoFlow River. No, I'm not talking about your full-size refrigerators, but a mini fridge, yes. Your washer and dryer, no, but all your TVs, your lights, your fans, the things that you're gonna need in the wake of a natural disaster, or just for having fun, hunting, camping, fishing, things like that, 
you are going, you having an outdoor barbecue, you can go ahead and maybe where, you know, uh, you want to plug in a, you know, like a, a movie projector or something like that. You can go ahead and plug in a movie projector if you have movie night. Now, I know we just went to a little B-roll footage there and you can see he's plugging that stuff in because I'm sitting here talking instead of plugging things in and showing you guys at home exactly what this is due. But whenever we come back, I'm going to show you exactly where you plug that fan in. And the reason why I'm doing everything live on air, because I want you to know that when you get this home it is going to do exactly what what i say it will it's not like i've got everything pre-plugged in and it's like oh cool the tv's on the light i'm plugging everything in as i go and you can plug in up to nine things at the same time i don't have to unplug one thing to plug in another i've got my my uh my tablet down in front if you see that i'm gonna go ahead and plug it into the front where i've got my usb c ports right here if i can see correctly so now my tablet's going to come on. Let's go ahead and get, I've got a phone right there next to it. These are our USB ports. I've got four of them right on the top here. You see my phone just came on down there. I know the graphics blocking it, but that's okay. You can kind of see it through there. Phone came on, tablets on, and those are your four USB ports like you're seeing right below the screen there. You've got two QuickTime ports. There's two in blue. That's if you want to plug in there. If your phone used to take four hours to charge, now it's only going to take two. And the two right next to it all in black, those are our regular USB ports. We plug in our phones and our tablets every day. We know how those work. And right below, those are going to be our USB-C ports. Lenovo's and MacBooks, they're all moving towards that in the next couple of years. Why is that important? Because that means the EcoFlow powers, power outlet is future-proof. You're not going to have to buy a new EcoFlow or buy adapters when your chargers change in a couple of years. So what is this really all about? It's a 21st century battery power generator that is giving you that peace of mind and that sense of security in any of life's unsuspecting moments. You're gonna be able to keep things moving and it's going to power that light and that fan that you saw me plug in, get this Shannon, for up to 100 hours before wow. you even have to rethink of charging the EcoFlow River. No gas, no oil, you get it home, there's no extra cost, unlike a gas generator where you gotta keep putting gas in, keep putting oil in, you got the sticky pull crank, you got the toxic fumes, none of that. It's completely silent, keep it next to your bed, Keep it in your car. Take it with you wherever you go. Think about the alternatives for a movie night with your family right now. We all have to social distance. We're thinking of alternatives to hunting, camping, fishing. Take this out back. Plug it into a movie projector. Plug a popcorn machine into it. Whatever it is, you're going to be able to keep your life powered and keep those fun times, not just the natural disasters. It's so true. I mean, it, it is, it's power on demand. It's power on the go. A couple of features, and then I'm going to give you some updates. Now, on the front, when I look at my cell phone, in fact, it's funny, I always bring my cell phone uh, on these sets. You know, the, what, the, what does that little battery mean? I love that it really shows you in real time. Like Justin said, you can plug in, you know, your cell phones and your CPAP machine and that little compact portable refrigerator. It's interesting mm -hmm. because we're all social distancing. Even I was reading one of my celebrity magazines and I won't say the name of the celebrity, but she's a Chrissy, if you can, you know, guess. She said that she bought camping equipment and, and she, you would never guess this woman would camp, but she's, she's like, we're gonna be in the backyard. So this takes glamping to a whole new level. But the other thing about it is you have to consider the alternative. We actually sell here at HSN, those big generators. I've aired them and I always tell the guests, I said, just so you know, I'm not even gonna stand next to it. I'm, I am, I'm, I'm, whether it's propane or the pole thing, I mean, I, I'm just not comfortable with that. Plus it's on the back porch or patio. I want power where I can see it. I want power in my kitchen. I want power in my living room. I certainly want power in my bedroom. If you have that CPAC machine, you know for a lot of us, this can be a light, life altering purchase for you. Speaking of light, Yes, it can power your lights. Now remember, you choose the black, the rose gold, the gold, or the blue. You get all the charging cables, you get that um, car adapter, that cigarette port, you get the custom designed case, 713284, free shipping, interest-free payments of $120 on your credit card. Justin, I don't know if you have it at home or not, but I don't have one out here. Do you have your little cheat, that little cheat uh, strip that you showed me? <gasps> Look at you. <laughs> oh, this is, I'm glad that this is like my favorite part. I'm glad you brought this up, Shannon, because many of you have this at home. It's a little power strip, a little surge protector. 
I know in the beginning I said you can plug in up to nine things at the same time. Well, I'm going to show you a way that you can quadruple the amount of household devices, not just your phones and your tablets, TVs, all that good stuff that you can plug into the back of the EcoFlow River. So here is my surge protector. Let's go ahead. And again, I want you to notice that is a high powered three prong outlet, not your dinky little two prongs, but your three prong outlets. Let's go ahead and plug that into the back. Now we see that just came on, but in case you can't see that at home, let's go ahead and start plugging it. Maybe we need a little bit more light. I got another light over there. So we've still got this light on over here next to me, but maybe we need another light for another bedroom or somewhere else in the house. So now that light came on. Now, what about our medical devices? So many of you at home use medical devices, your CPAP machines, your nebulizers, things like that. I know you mentioned that at the top, Shannon. I brought a CPAP machine right down here. Pay attention to that screen. You're gonna see that light up and I can just keep going. Watch all of this stuff that I am plugging in. You see the CPAP machine down here just came on. I've still got my lights going. So many of us are working from home nowadays and maybe we're not used to working with the other person we live with, whether that be our wife, our, our husband, or our, our kids, we have multiple offices set up around our house, right? Not just our, our regular office, but maybe we've got an office set up at our, at our dining room table or something like that. And we need to have access to be able to do our work. Well, maybe if you lose power, it doesn't necessarily mean that you lose your internet. Your internet's always out there. What happens when you lose power is that you lose power to your router. So let's go ahead and right now I brought a router here and you see like she's doing there in the B-roll, it's as easy as just turning the, turn on the power and start plugging things in. There's no gas, no oil, no tricky configuration. So I brought my router here with me and I'm gonna go ahead and plug it into my surge protector. So now, or power strip, now we're gonna see, you see my router here just lit up. Now I've got the internet, I've got my computer here. So let's go ahead and plug that in to, this is a Apple, like I said, that is a USB-C plug, but you can also plug it into the AC adapter, your wall outlets. Let's go ahead and plug in the Apple. Now I've got power going to my computer. You probably just heard that, come on. There we go. So now I've got power going to the computer. I've got my router going. I can do my work. I've got two lights. I've got, oh, you know what? I forgot to plug my fan back in. You might be sitting at home being like, oh, I thought that fan was on. Look at all this stuff I am plugging in. You see the little streamers going? I have that just in case at home you don't believe me. I've got my medical device going, two lights, two fans, and I've even got a drill here that I can go ahead and plug in that I want to show you here. So I bought, I bought, or what do I have here? I've got a power tool that I am plugging in. Check this out. Just in and of the name itself, this produces or takes, draws an immense amount of power. I've got this TV going. It's a 32 inch high definition TV and the power drill. I mean, the power this thing puts off is incredible, Shannon. And you're gonna be able to, now, the light and the fan, like I said, you can leave those going for about four days. FEMA recommends that you have three days of provisions on your hand immediately following a natural disaster. Well, this is going to allow you to have the lights and fans giving you that peace of mind and that sense of security for four days before you ever need to rethink about recharging the river. And before you ask Shannon, I'll go ahead and tell you there are three ways that you can recharge the river. As you can see there, there's a gentleman, he's doing his work from home and he's got his router plugged in. There's your nice, easy to read LCD display. It's telling you the amount of hours and watts in and watts out. So you never are left with without power. You've got that uninterrupted power source, not those four little LED dot fuel gauges that you know they go down and you've got 25%, 50%. This tells you down to the minute when you need to repower this, right? So what that means is there's three ways to recharge this. You can recharge this and you're gonna get these at home. You can recharge this in the wall, just like you would plug in a toaster or anything like that. You can recharge this in your car as well. Yes, you can keep this in your car. We're gonna give you the car charger. And you can also, might be on hsn.com, but you can recharge it with a solar panel as well and go off the grid and have a completely good time off the grid, giving you that, that uh, uninterrupted power for days and weeks on end with the perfect 21st century battery power generator. In fact, you know what, Justin, I'm gonna have my producer, Allison, see if we have any of those solar chargers on hsn.com. This is okay. what Justin was talking about. There's that, that real-time readout, which is so helpful. Actually, in the time that Justin was talking, I'll just show you here on the back. Now, remember, you can do a cheat. It is a power strip, not a power sheet. 
can tell it's been a long week for me, but you, <laughs> yes, but I mean, you can plug it in directly to the unit or you can use that power strip. It's entirely up to you. But uh, remember we, oh no, oh, the solar powers are, uh, panels are gone, but it looks, mm. I'm sure we'll, we'll try to get them back. That's always a very popular adjacency. People always ask about it. You know, Justin, I know time is short, but in a nutshell, when people look at this, you kind of have to rethink. It's yep. it's not like the generator. You and I and your lovely wife Valerie. By the way, is she? Will I call her out? Is she doing camera work tonight? Is she behind no, the? No, she no no no. She's she's just uh, she's somewhere else. She, <laughs> she's somewhere else in the house here. She's, I, I've she's, just got the camera set up on She's basking in the the, the self quarantining, you know, and hopefully doing some of her own self care because we love her beauty show. Um, but yeah. we we've lived through Hurricane Irma here at HSN, and it's it's funny because. It's only when there's that national emergency but that people start thinking, oh, I should get that generator. They're, they're hundreds and hundreds of dollars, but they're really complicated. I, my own opinion, dangerous to me because I'm afraid to monkey around with that stuff. Yeah. But this is that power generator or that power on demand. And to me, more importantly, it's where I need it. That, that big old gas or propane generator that's out on my back deck, that doesn't necessarily do me a lot of good when I'm trying to power my fan or trying to power my, my, my CPAP machine. I'm, you know, I'm trying to figure out how you'd even finagle like extension cords. I, I don't even know what you do in that situation. Well, here's, here's a very important thing and, and thing to note that you just brought up, Shannon, is that with the gas generators, you have to keep those outside, 20 feet away from your house. That's a law because of the toxic fumes, right? Plus the mess that they, they, they give off, right? So, but here's the thing, when you are running the power cords from the things you want to run, your lights, your fans, your TVs in your house, you have to run those through an open window or an open door to your gas power generator. Now, that's fine but that poses an immense security risk. That's a big safety issue for many, many people. And you can't even have a gas power generator if you live in an apartment or a town home or somewhere with a strict HOA guidelines, right? But with the EcoFlow River, you keep it inside. You keep it next to your bed. You keep your medical devices plugged into it at night in case you were to have an uninter, uh, you know, uh, a power outage, a rolling blackout, and your medical devices will keep operating because they're plugged into this. But like I said, you're going to be able to keep it inside. You don't have to run the power course through an open door, an open window at night. Like I said, that's a that's just a, a crazy safety issue that. You know, we have enough to worry about right now with everything going on in the world, these unprecedented times. The last thing we want to worry about is our safety. We want to be able to lock our doors and windows. And if we do have power, whether it's a hurricane, whether it's earthquakes, I think Puerto Rico just had a big earthquake yesterday, whether it's your floods, your winter storms, which by the way, winter storms are the leading causes cause of power outages nationwide according, according to FEMA every year. So those of you living up north or in the northeast, you know all about that, the, us here in the south. We're currently in less than 30 days preparing for hurricane season. And if you haven't started thinking about preparation up until now, well, now is the time to do it because when you do lose that power, it's as simple as literally taking this off the shelf because it's going to hold that charge for 12 months or take it out of the cabinet wherever you keep it. You're going to be able to press that power button, turn your lights on, turn your fans on, get life back to normal, get that sense of security and that peace of mind much quicker and easier than ever before, leading you in to much safer, much less panic, much less vulnerable times like we know we feel, we can all relate when we lose that power. And you're gonna be able to power TVs, lights, fans, all sorts of great stuff. I can take this TV and walk anywhere around my house with it right now. A 32 inch television, I mean medical devices, phones, Wi-Fi routers, fans, lights, you name it, this is going to be able to power all that stuff. You got it all, my friend. The best to you. Have a wonderful weekend. Thank you for joining us at the last minute. We appreciate it. Thank you, Justin. Thank you. All right, take good care. Hey, if you are just channel surfing, welcome. This is actually the, the finale today. We were making you at home. I'm Shannon. This is HSN. And in case you missed it, well, in case, unless you're calling now, you could miss it entirely. Samsung is a name you recognize whether you've watched HSN or not. They are the number one flat panel or number one television brand in America. They are doing what is called a smart deal. For lack of a better term, it's almost as if this were a today's special, except we have far fewer of them than we would if it were a today's special.